Hello and welcome to part 3 of this Civilization 4. Let's play with playing as Bismarck and the German Empire. And we're building lots of wonders, hence the title. Now, I'm starting to get a slight bit concerned about the fact that we're surrounded by enemies with nowhere else to build. But we're looking quite strong for what we have. Let's see what we want here. We've built a barracks. Uh, I don't think I needed to rush that barracks, but okay. Uh, let's get a forge out next. And uh, I'm not sure why he's hi highlighted. Okay. Oh, we don't even have that ivory. That'll help our happiness a lot. And I guess we should link these guys up with a road for um, for military military reasons. All right. There's lots of people down here. Um, they're quite weak, though. I guess they're. Um, Mayhem? Mayhem? Um, I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. Uh, I think Arabic. He's probably going to wipe these guys out. Probably going to uh, vassalize them, if that's a word. Right, so that's one thing to keep in mind. Over here, let's let's actually go around the houses a bit and see what we can uh, think of. Uh, we have Churchill here. He's a little weaker than us. And I do like the idea of getting coastal cities now this doesn't necessarily look like a coastal city uh, unless he's right there but no I can see that tile and he is not there um, I would like this city though I'd like to push up over this direction along the coast to make use of my great lighthouse that's an option that's a, an attacking option now who have we got we got yeah we got the Dutch here Wilhelm that's also a an option, although he's the second strongest. It's the same strength as us for all intents and purposes. That's another or like I'm I'm thinking I just build up defenses, stay building my wonders, stay building my um, technology, wait for a convenient war. Now let's check out if there is any kind of wars going on uh, that might be convenient for us. Shaka versus the Egyptians and Shaka versus. I'm gonna Mehmet. Mehmet. I'm gonna go with Mehmet. Uh, where is Shaka? I don't necessarily see him on the map. We're, I guess we can make the assumption he's over here if he's fighting the Egyptians as well. In which case, I wish him all the best and it could, could be a good chance to attack um, the Arabs. Unfortunately, though, this jungle stops it. Um, the fact that I have no army stops it. <laughs> Lots of things stop it. Although, if that's a city right, that'd be a tasty city to take. On the coast, um, not too far away from my border. But I think it's a little unrealistic. Right, also, while we're at it, let's check out um, any resources or techs we might be able to trade. Okay, we can trade metal casting. It's not necessarily too useful to us anymore. Hannibal's a weak state. We get mathematics for it. That's not the best trade in the world, but it's something. Uh, unfortunately, we can't tr multiply, multiple trade it with lots of people. Uh, I guess. I guess maybe this. Has Churchill already got? Yeah, he's got a lot more than me. Okay, I see. Uh, I'll go ahead and take that trade with Hannibal. Although it's a terrible, terrible trade. Oh, Alphabet might be a little more up his street. Right, that's a, a little bit better of an offer. If in me. other sciences we should arrive at certainty without doubt, and I don't have mathematics error, yet, <clears throat> it behooves us to place the foundation have of marble in mathematics. Yeah, I should have really begun uh, mathematics and calendar. Art for art's sake is We've got lots theory. of wonders here. Art for I'm the just sake gonna of make truth. sure that art for the sake that's of the good my... and the beautiful. That is the faith that I am searching if for. If I could get codes of law I'd love to I'd love to get it if I could get a religion. Let's just click it for the moment and see what offers we have. Let's let's try and get all of this. <laughs> let's I want everything. So let's um 
see who else can research codes of law pretty much everybody so it's not very likely it's not very likely I will uh, get to, get to this religion nine turns no not very likely at all but I feel maybe worth going for still now what about aesthetics as well um, yeah not many people have it that's good for us I would like to try and get the wonders out of it so we can afford maybe to go for a pyramid first I am a little concerned about the lack of protection On. We'll we'll save this guy just in case we get um, just in case we get a religion. Let's let's go back to I keep forgetting to micromanage these cities. I just I'm not I'm necessarily able for it. Uh, we might as well stagnate because he doesn't have enough health. And let's see what do you want to build? Oh, you're you've stagnated yourself anyway. Wonder. Um, I would, I'd be happy to go along with that choice you have made. Okay, and see the other cities. I'd certainly just like him to grow uh, food-wise, because he could, he can potentially build me a wonder in a couple of turns, I think. And again, I'd like him to grow food-wise and culture-wise as well, probably more importantly. Once he gets that forge, we'll have him build buildings. Yeah, I need both these jungles gone in case of an invasion. Uh, I would love a golden age at the moment, though, to speed up all these wonders and to speed up codes of law. We want them, what we get are often two completely different things. The Egyptians, I care nothing for the Egyptians. Uh, I'd like to keep you on my good side, so. I wish you would tell me what, what deals we're talking about here. Have I got any important deals with the Egyptians? Yeah, I'd like to keep uh, Wilhelm on my side, so let's uh, go ahead with that. Let's look. We forgot to look at resources. Okay, Wilhelm and Hatsburg. Well, I've just cancelled deals. It's a whore, so we just go with Wilhelm. That doesn't look like I have anything extra to give. Okay, Shaka and Haspa has made peace. Um, a bit concerned about any kind of growth over here. I need to get some uh, some workers out of that site. Yeah, I don't think it's all that realistic to. I don't know, I think maybe he could squeeze out, um, say, Statue of Zeus. Let's see if we can do that. Yeah, he's not going to have much food going forward. We'll see. Um, he could work this hill. So let's put down this forest and put a mine up there. Although that's a lot of his foods probably come from up here. Yeah, well one of his foods at least. Uh, if we build an aqueduct, does that mean we can farm around? Don't think so. What is this en enemy we speak of? Uh, barbarians I assume because I do have a uh, great wall.
Okay, this uh, code of law may, may get there. Although we're about to slow down significantly. Yeah, six more turns. Okay, treacherous Sulu. Um, no, but I will maybe go to war with the English. I have a bit of a history in my Civ games going to war with the English. I hope it's, that doesn't say something about my psyche. Well, uh, let's let's get one of these out to this uh, this town up here. He's probably going to be the first to fall to any invasion by the Arabs. Oh wow! Somebody's already built the whatever that golden uh, that golden uh, one there is. Uh, he might be able to build a hanging gardens. Okay. Oh, I just put him to sleep. <laughs> That's uh, not advisable. Okay, speaking of spies, this warning up here, I'm not sure if you guys can read that, but speaking of spies, let's have a look what we've waited. Oh, we've waited? Nobody. Okay, um, I feel... Let's, um... We'll keep, we'll keep the Egyptians on nothing, and we'll keep Shaka, which I feel is about to get wiped out, on nothing. We'll get the English on one, Hannibal on one, Mehmed on one, and um, not a Hannibal, sorry, I'm not that worried about Hannibal, I think he might get wiped out as well. Wilhelm on one, uh, but then let's up. I'm most worried about Mehmed because uh, he seems to have weak sieves around him that he's going to be able to steamroll over. Uh, the Dutch and the English will keep each other in check um, significantly, so yeah, let's, uh, let's leave it like that. We get the religion. To bring I didn't about see the anybody else get it. In the land okay, that's good. The should not arm the weak. Uh, we'll try and we'll try and get a golden age calendar. Spread up the gold, speed up the golden age, and then start spreading this religion ASAP. Okay, I'd like to wait until we start, uh, until we at least start building the wonder before I, I trade out this technology uh, too much. Uh-oh. Oh, he... Wait, who's he at war with? I feel like he's, he's, he's just moving over the other side of the world to attack someone else. Or maybe Shaka is over this side. If the English are at war with them, where is Shaka and who and who's who the hell's he fighting? He's fighting everybody. Oh, there he is. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Um I don't particularly like it's coming through my border and all, but he's unlikely to attack me with this with this um, force. Although that is an impressive force. A scary force to me at least. Oh, I've ignored my central city there. Um, and ignored its happiness at least. Right, so let's stop its food growth. Let's see, yeah, we can take off. Let's take this guy off and we'll add in a scientist let him starve oh 
you know what we could do? Let's uh, go back to normal. We could speed up this. Uh, cost three population. Oh, we can't. Okay, we don't have some slavery. And do we want this guy? To, we don't particularly want you to grow either. Let's uh, end a little bit of your food. There we go, that's a little better. And let's see what this tech situation is. Alright, there's definitely a bit of trading we can do. But like I said, I'd like to at least start building um, Chicken Itza. Have him do hang gardens. And have this guy do chicken pizza. Oh, just failed doing the pyramids. Unlucky. And an engineer. Let's. Like, it's not the most powerful wonder to speed up. But the fact it will give me a lot of protection, a lot of defensive bonus. And sort of way I'm playing right now. It's it's very static. It's very sit and wait. That could be that could be very valuable. But I I hate it as an idea. What else would this wonder be? No, nothing much. Just uh, I guess great profit uh, points. Defense in all cities though. It's not to be it's not to be sneezed at. And eight culture. We could certainly go for a cultural victory. I'm gonna speed that up, and then we can just go straight ahead and start trading a little bit. Let's try and plan this out. So we would like to finish off calendar and get monarchy. We might get them both in one go. We could get horse riding while we're at it, and that's all. So let's just pick our. Shaka wants everything. He has nothing. It's good to see. Um, let's pick basically our two weakest people. Um, I'd like to keep Shaka in the fight, but unfortunately he doesn't have any technology to give back. Hannibal, where are you? Let's have to be the Dutch for uh, horseback riding if I want to get that. Let's see. About 500. So he'll probably value that around 400 or so. So I'd probably only just get horseback riding. Um, what would... Wait. What would these put together? Well, I'd definitely get both of them, but... I don't think that would be worth it for me. Yeah, forget horseback riding. I'm just going to trade with Hannibal and... That's what's two bad deals. Like, yeah, we, we still can't get any money though. Um, unfortunately, pity I cannot throw in a. Which are these two? Got a cheap one for calendar because it's nearly finished. Pity I can't throw anything else into this deal. <laughs> what? Why why wouldn't you take that deal? Let's come back we'll come back to you with a better deal in a minute. Oh you don't want the other one. Let's go back to the list. Back to the list. Right, I would like a calendar give calendar up for just aesthetics. It's the cheaper one. But I don't want to really deal with any of my richer neighbors. Any of my more, not richer, but more powerful neighbors. Whereas, you know, I just give up codes a lot about them. I have the religion, I have the wonder. They're not really all that valuable. The courthouses, I suppose, are. Alright, here you go. Calum? Oh, eh. Uh, we'll give the better deal to the weakest person. Or she will. For everything, there is a season and a time for every purpose under heaven. Okay, what will we research next? I 
I think literature. Let's keep this uh, wonders going. Hannibal, what deal have I got left for you? A multitude of rulers is not a good thing. Let there be one ruler, one king. Okay, and once um, once these hang gardens finish, we'll we we'll start building. Or maybe I can do it with this city here. I'll start building uh, mausoleum mausoleums, and we can speed up our our research of everything also what can I get any happiness is anybody willing to trade um, like I have nothing I can trade I have one of everything like I'd love to just get some of this spice or this or How come I don't have two iron? Oh, we're, we're not quite there yet. Or two uh, ivory. Let's get over there and get that. Uh, start trading it. Anything else I'm wasting my time on? Right, that's definitely going to help uh, the defense. Like, I can't hurt it. And that will also help in any kind of war. The fact that we we'll, we won't be as war weary as it were. Okay, I think uh, I don't think an aqueduct actually helps any kind of war. I need you, I think you need some sort of higher technology for that. I I am just going to build a few archers. <laughs> I'm getting a little concerned about that fact. going to be a long time coming but I'm going to build uh, Maori, Maori statues and I think it's probably going to be worth let's train 8 swordsmen whilst any, lots of other people will have already have that so that um, quest is not going to be alive long enough for me to build a swordsman. Um, can't remember what I was going to say. Oh, I think I'll sacrifice one of these forests at least, maybe both of them, to speed up this uh, mausoleum. Are you building for me an archer? Let's just build another archer until you level up another one. That's a very, that's a very uh, weak city down here. Doesn't have a lot of defenses, although it's border. But I don't have a big army to come and attack people on the plains. All I have is archers to defend, which is probably not long term. I need to, if if I'm playing this style, I need to keep a better look on my relationships with people. And like nobody's happy with. Everybody's cautious. Nobody's upset with me, though. That's a, that's I suppose is a good thing. And um, I, I never really pay attention to a lot of this. I have to say, what's this number here? Ten. It looks like open borders. How many deals we have? Our happiness level. Like, let's see, where's Wilhelm of Orange? Hmm. Actually, I have no idea what this. Uh, this number indicates. Please help me out if anybody if anybody wishes. And at that at that we'll leave it there. Uh, our population is about to increase, which is a bit of a shame for one or two of these cities. Uh, but it's a, a huge boon to some of them. And uh, mausoleum. Hopefully we'll get to mausoleum. And then we'll start up. We'll just start up a golden age. Speak to them. Oh my god, I'm throwing money away here. Great profit. Get the hell down here. We'll start up a golden age with that uh, great engineer. Although it feels a little wasteful we'll using an engineer for it. But it's 12 turns of the golden age if we get the muzzle in. Well, tune in next time and we'll see how that goes. Thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.